Hi Capricorns, beautiful Capricorns. Thanks so much everybody for your likes, your subscribes, and for your comments. Be aware there's a scammer. There's a scammer almost every day. So be aware. Thanks for everybody for reporting these idiots who were using my picture to like harass and basically it is harassing people. I do not have WhatsApp. I never have. I never will. And I am not accepting any personal readings at this time. So if you get solicited, it is not me, beautiful Capricorns. I don't operate that way. Many of you already know that. Let's find out what's going on for the beautiful Capricorns. Capricorns, what's going on for Capricorns? What is the current energy? Ooh, exchanging gifts here. First card out. Somebody's had a fork in the road. Time to go. Truth be told. It's the never-ending story. Someone has been orphaned or feeling like an orphan. It's like, here we go again. But somebody has decided to move forward and go the distance. Tell the truth. There is exchanging of gifts here. So this is the feminine energy now. I think you are finding someone who you're exchanging gifts with that will go the distance. What's going on here? A new life. Let, letting something go, I'm telling you. It's faded. Somebody wants to co-create or is. Some there's some change in the wind. Someone is imagining hmm, this is community. <laughs> Not for you. It's like I've already been flexible. Rebuilding on your treasure island. Someone is getting their treasure island about to be blessed so they can rebuild. This is someone you can build with. This is a blessing. It's Treasure Island coming in, guys. Exchanging gifts. Yep. Somebody is chopped wood and somebody's asking why. It could be this masculine asking why. Doing a lot of thinking about building with you is observing you. Something needs to go by the book. All I do know it's time. TikTok is here. Goes around, comes around. This unfinished symphony, unfinished business. Somebody had to clean it up. It's like I've heard it all before. There's a change in the wind. Just breathe. You found your peace. You found your happy place. You're happy. It's all too familiar. It's like, I've done this before. It's like, I've met this person before or I know this person. It's in the here and the now. Whatever it is, you're rebuilding. You're being, yeah. All that glittered wasn't gold. There's a new soulmate coming in. You've been on a rest, but... There's no place like home. It's like this person is helping you get your milk and honey. You're going to receive a message. You're going to have a deep knowing. To be fair, somebody is going for it. There's a higher power involved here. It is, oh, <laughs> it is a loyal heart. Spirit's just wham. You're meeting a new soulmate. Who is loyal? Who will go the distance? 
it's uh, exchanging gifts. It's like you've left something in the past that needed to be let go of. You've heard it all before. It's like repeat, repeat, repeat. Now, I got to say for some of you, a past person wants to return and be loyal. For others of you, this is a brand new soul mate who you who actually does have a loyal heart. The, you both have loyal hearts. It is a higher power involved. Somebody's going for this and something is fair is going to make you very, very happy. Someone, there's no place like home. It's like someone you can be comfortable with. It is your milk and honey. Treasure Island, hello. Yeah. Who's going to help you mend? It's very balanced. It's, this person is upright. Capricorn. Others of you, it's clearly somebody wants to reconcile. If you know you're not reconciling, it's a brand new person. It doesn't have to be. Take it as it resonates. If you know you're not entertaining love, this could be a partnership of finance that brings you in your treasure island, your milk and honey. But clearly, a soulmate can be a friend, a business partner, a family member, anyone who's dear to your heart. It also is career. That's going to bring you in a lot of abundance. Mm. Yeah, you're in your power here. And it's almost as if, oh, wow. This emperor is strong. This emperor is very strong. Somebody's getting their emperor. An emperor is very strong. Has made a decision. Someone's standing in their power. They're making a plan. It could even be ooh, building. This is work. This is finance. This is abundance. Making plans. Hmm. Logical. Insightful. Blunt. An intellectual challenge. It could have been very tiresome, but here's balance here. Combining ideas of others and your own to create something extraordinary successful compromise the power of diversity self-control patience and balance whoa somebody is getting their emperor and for others of you you could be this emperor getting something financially lucrative feminine or masculine you're being blessed this is something you're working on hmm. making choices to your path Somebody could have been in their ego. And you're planning for the long term. Abundance is coming. So it could be that you got a lot going on at the time. It could be what you're working on. Sure. Well, someone's very decisive what they want. They're willing to fight like hell for whatever it is. There is a transformation here, a renewal. Reviewing the past with compassion and forgiveness. Time to head in a new direction. Clarity on your life purpose. You know what to do. Power. 
powerful and often unexpected revelations, breaking free of procrastination, releasing old belief systems. I told you there's new, there's abundance coming in. A romantic relationship or a deep friendship, awakening of psychic abilities, spiritual insights, a, a love letter or a new home. Listen to your intuition. You've got much to celebrate. Send gratitude to the divine and the angels for the peace and prosperity that's coming to you. Peace and contentment in your personal life. You're going to get a revelation that's going to make everything clear. Unnecessary worry. Let go of your fears. Listen to your intuition and pay attention to the signs from the divine. Mm -hmm. And at the end of a situation that brings relief. Sadness or both. The opportunity for new happiness. There's a weight being lifted off your shoulders. Look at this. A windfall of abundance. Good fortune, exciting career opportunities, a lucrative contract, significant purchases like a new home or a vehicle, wise counsel, unity with a spiritually minded community, ask the divine for help and trust the answers will come. Compare traditional methods with new ideas to see which is best for you. It's a two cup situation. Falling in love or the resurgence of a romantic relationship. Forgiveness and the ending of challenges. Exchanging gifts. Don't give up on people you love. You have a victory. Wise choices that bring public recognition and success. Promotions, award or scholarships. A brilliant success. A time of joyful accomplishment and spiritual enlightenment. Freedom to do whatever you want. Be proud of yourself. An amazing opportunity. Be bold, courageous, and optimistic. Now is the time to take action. Do what you're passionate about. So like I said, it could be within business. It definitely could be a partnership or a new romantic love situation or a rekindling of that. And it is... Got to be aware of other people's actions at this time. Somebody could have been juggling you or juggling your finances. Something in the past, revisiting dreams or plans, embracing your inner child. The return of people or romances from your past or romanticizing how things used to be. Hmm. Yeah, someone's doing a lot of worrying about the past. And it doesn't mean it has to be you. You're sitting here busy working. Someone's feeling like they were trapped somehow or they're doing a lot of thinking. And it's like someone could be trapped in the past. But it's an illusion. Trust your intuition. Meditate and turn inward to discover your soul's true desire. It's not so develop your intuitive gifts and trust the wisdom that you're receiving. Hmm. Someone could be having fears surrounding money, reaching out to others for assistance, poor timing. <clears throat> you may have had to leave someone out in the cold or someone has been left out in the cold or someone is fearing something to do with money, but it's an illusion. Because magic is alive in your life. And what you need to be a success will manifest. 
if you believe it, you can do it. So whatever these fears are, you, whatever seeds that you're planting or sowing is going to come to fruition. So if you're feeling stuck, you got to release that and follow your dreams. But someone is like... You've got the Wheel of Fortune here in your favor. It's time to make a change. If you're thinking this way, Spirit is saying it's time. Um, it's time to make a decision. It's time to manifest. Making, it could be an employment change. It could be a career change. It could be that someone is staying stuck in a situation because of finances know that the wheel of fortune is in your favor and someone is sitting here this is a commitment this is you financially stable getting a, this is abundance guys it's like charitable Charitable, receiving and giving, finances. All the good deeds that you've done come back to you. This is, yeah, for whatever broke your heart here, you're showing up as the nine, the ten of pentacles. You're, you're fine, single. It's like you're being rewarded for all your good deeds, all your charity work, all your time and energy you spent giving, giving, giving. It's coming back to you. Yeah. There is new romance here. There is new love situations here. There is your Ten of Cups coming in if you were feeling ignored. You're getting justice here. You're sitting here like it's telling you to manage your resources carefully. There is justice for you. It's almost like Spirit is saying you're getting justice for all your charitable work. All the giving that you're been giving is coming back to you and it's like telling you to manage your resources carefully because you're getting some abundance well nine and ten of pentacles hello balance to be fair I, it's in the here and the now you're protected it's like you're being guided. Yeah, if you were sad, it's like you're not going to be. Something has come to an end, but boom, here's this abundance coming in. That is new love. That is rekindling of old love. That's also moving forward. This is the abundance I'm talking about. Love, money, whatever. Someone is... Someone's coming in. And it's like someone is feeling like worried or feeling like they're trapped somehow or it's an illusion. They're not trapped. They're free to go at any time. Or someone keeps thinking about you. Someone's doing a lot of like they're stuck on you. Someone's in love with you. You are getting success. This is a wish coming true. The angels are telling you you're, uh, you're getting a wish come true. But someone's like, yeah, you will be celebrating. Masculine, it's going to come as a shock to you. You're going to celebrate something. This is masculine and feminine. Uh, Capricorns being totally financially stable here grounded dedicated loyal you'll be celebrating something 
yeah it is a wish coming true and it's like it, someone needs to stop procrastinating and move forward because yeah fast forward movement yeah and it's like <laughs> someone from the past is returning guys and messaging and if you've turned your back on the past and you know you're not reconciling this could be your kids this could be someone from your past returning meaning an old friend meaning an old lover meaning an old business partner a message is coming in from the past that could be in business that could be from your children or people that you're close to an old friend even someone who's you think of fondly here's this empress hmm. comes around goes around someone's in love with you just saying yeah they know where the path is it's being lit up for them this is your ten of cups now i'm saying this is a love situation that you're going to work on it's also a business contract of some type guys it's a plan you're working on someone you can work with or you're doing business with in your future a close connection that you partner up with and it's like someone is making a decision is going to weigh something out here because they're the truth is you're manifesting this is manifesting before your eyes this is honest clear cut honest communication that's coming in you have a victory with something you're working at that you've been manifesting and working on you're having a victory with it Ooh. so that wants to come in reverse it is honest communication someone has chosen their path and it is a new start and it's also to do with work making the decision you might have to um somebody wants passionate beginning with you and it could be to do with your work it could be to do with love it's both here so you know your own circumstance but yeah someone has to face their fears and it's like someone's doing a lot of thinking and investing here it's an emperor and empress situation a marriage a partnership purchasing a home or working on purchasing a home or building a home something like that you're being observed and there's jealousy around you somebody wants to apologize to you for like something to do with finances or leaving you out in the cold someone's passionate about you and it could feel like i don't have enough money they could have took in your money <laughs> you're gonna follow your intuition but regardless you're moving forward this is yeah something burdened you and it's almost as if this is being brought into you to right wrongs someone was deceptive someone could have created a lot of turmoil in your life a lot of drama a lot of competition you get the victory and they've yeah as above so below now you're pushing somebody away and you're angry at somebody from your past that you've ended things with but you're getting happiness and a new blessing here this is a financial blessing this is a commitment this is a new opportunity it could very well be with your finances yeah 
and you're going to have to choose. Somebody walked away, you got the truth, you're single, you were heartbroken. It's finances. Here's a friend reaching out to you, paying you back for something. Someone is coming forward, and it's almost as if it gives you all your money back. You taking a leadership role here. It's payback time. And here's Ten Pentacles. Yeah, if you were trying to hang, it could be that, oh, oh, this is karmic blessings, guys. If someone ghosted you or you had to ghost somebody for whatever gong show that they did to you or in business, I told you it could be a business partner as well, whatever shady shit went down. They're getting their karma for it, and you're getting karmic blessings for it. You're being blessed with a new soulmate. This could be a soulmate returning as well. But irregardless, it's payback time. Spirit is saying you're being blessed financially. You're also being blessed, others of you, with a new soulmate, someone who's going to be a long-term commitment. But in finances... <laughs> He cannot. This is like what comes around goes around here. It's like whatever you put out, whatever you contributed, you're being rewarded like tenfold for. Right? It's unbelievable. Milk and honey here. It's like, were you done dirty? Expect some goodness to come out of it. And a lot of it. Single, coupled, or any other way, you're showing up as the nine, the ten of pentacles. It's very similar to the Sagittarian reading, the nine, the ten of pentacles. So you may have Saggy in your chart or dealing with someone with a Sagittarian placement. Because they're showing up the same, the 9, the 10, and many Capricorns have Sagittarian placements in their chart and vice versa. Which is why you guys are so closely connected here. Signs that are that close in the Zodiac chart, you're going to be, it depends what's in your natal chart, but I can assure you that it's a similarity here, guys. Take care. Good luck.